Hi. My name is Florin. I will present you the configuration of a Deer and GUI application in Raspberry Pi OS. Deer and GUI, Immediate Mode Graphical User Interface, is a graphical user interface library designed for creating simple and efficient user interfaces in real-time applications, particularly those involving interactive graphics and simulations. First access github.com slash awkwarnut and copy git clone command. Second step to use Deer and GUI with OpenGL 2 on Raspberry Pi OS, you'll need to set up the necessary libraries and dependencies. Here's a step-by-step -step guide. 1. To install required packages open a terminal on your Raspberry Pi and install the required packages. OpenGL, GCC and G++, Git, Visual Studio Code, Make 2. Clone and GUI using command git clone from github.com slash awkwarnut. 3. Open Visual Studio Code using command code dot. Please follow the instruction on the screen. Third step is to create a folder for our demo application, and inside that folder the following folders. In GUI, backends, src. From MGUI library copy the content of MGUI to our demo application MGUI folder. Copy the content of backends to our backends folder.
Copy the CPP and make file of the OpenGL2 example folder to your SRC folder. And now to be able to build the application we have to modify the make file a bit. To modify the make file, we must open the Visual Studio Code application and edit this file. Rename the application name to mg underscore demo underscore gl2. Add ng slash to the source path. Build flags for Windows and Apple software platforms are not used and can be deleted. Open a terminal in Visual Studio Code and change directory to SRC. Now execute the make command and correct the eventual errors that might appear. If the build and linking of the demo application was successfully, then you can run the application like this. Slash mg underscore demo underscore gl2. Now the demo application with mgui library can be seen on the screen. Enjoy dear mgui.
If you consider this video useful please like and subscribe. Thank you for attention.